Hey peeps, Jelly Baby here. Just gonna do a party K look. I'm gonna start with a beauty blender. It's a bit dirty, not gonna lie. Are you starting out with Smashbox Faro Finish? It's a little travel one, so I don't know if it'll last long. Oof. Hopefully. But yeah, so I'm just putting it on my beauty blender. Just gonna make some weird faces as I always do. <laughs> I'm using my cap on the Interstellar palette from Mirror. Excuse that. Yeah, I'm just rubbing it into my face. I'm so spotty at the moment. It's a nightmare. But yeah, I need to get on that. Ugh. Don't ask about faces, I have no idea. <laughs> but yeah, going on to NARS Radiant Concealer. I've got medium custard, but I think it's a bit too dark. I don't know, you, you can't really see, I don't know what I'm doing. You can't see that, don't even try. There's no point. Oh well. <laughs> Just gonna smear that on my spots. Probably not the best way to deal with them, but you know. But yeah, blending that in with a like, beauty blender again. I so need to wash it, it's disgusting. <laughs> oh well. Blendy blend, blend, blend. Ugh, it always takes me so long to do this bit. So that's that. Fun times. Uh, next, I'm using the Kat Von D Lock It Foundation. I'm using like a light cool 44. I'm not really sure if it's actually my right shade to be honest because it always it looks fine on here, but in person it's a bit off. Like, you know, when your foundation's just not quite there and you're not happy. <laughs> yeah, I've got that. Yeah, once again, taking the same beauty blender. Just gonna smear that on. Spot on my forehead is relentless. Ugh. I can see it from a mile away. Ugh. A struggle. Gotta get that neck. <clears throat> yeah, we're using the Stay Matte Foundation. Uh, not foundation, powder, doy. I'm not really sure if I like this yet or not, to be honest. It's by Rimmel London. It's like, it's good, but like, I don't know. I don't know, I'm just very picky. Gotta get that nose. <laughs> yeah, next we're taking the NYX Jumbo Pencil in milk. I'm running out so bad. Ugh. So I'm using like this little brush because I cannot get that near my eye. But usually I just put it straight on my eyelid. Not gonna lie. But yeah, I'm just gonna use that as a eyeshadow base. Because I feel like my eyeshadow should just look so much better with a base. I usually use the Urban Decay potion, but I'm running out and trying to save it just for the good night time, you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm just taking that and putting it on the inner corner on my eyelid so I get that nice base and a little highlight on the corner. Gotta love a good open eye. Give it a little smudge and a rub in so it's not like. For some reason the brush puts it on really dodgy and it annoys me, but I can't really do anything about it at the moment, so I'm just gonna have to deal with it. <clears throat> yeah, next I'm taking this Revolutions Ultimate Eyeshadow Palette. It's pretty good actually, considering I got it for Christmas. You're just gone. It's actually really good, but I'm taking these two pink shades. I've hit pan on them so bad. <laughs> I don't use them too much. I'm taking, um, I'm using the Naked 3 palette brush. It's alright. It's a bit, I don't know, it's a bit hit and miss with me. Like, I like it some days, and then other days it just does not want to copyright. But yeah, I'm sticking that on my eyelids. All over pink. Yay. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not very good with eyeshadow. I've just, I've only been using it for about a year now, so. <laughs> My blending's not the best. But you know, gotta make it work somehow. Yeah, I'm taking this 
quite nice blue. It's really pigmented. We'll think, like, considering it's from a drugstore, it's so pigmented. And yes, I know. I know. I'll get to the blending, don't worry. I like to put it on first, make sure I've got the same amount on each eye, you know. Either that or I just end up with a, a mess of an eye, and nobody wants that. Yeah, so just taking the other side and just gonna blend it out a bit. Or attempt to. Blending brush is a bit dodge. I'm gonna lie. Yeah, now I'm taking a silver one. I'm gonna put it in my crease. It's mainly just so I can blend the two colours out in the crease a bit better, because for some reason my crease just hates me. But I'll be putting some blue on the, over the top in a minute anyway. But it gives it a nice shine, I suppose. Not that you can really see that, my camera's a bit rubbish. <laughs> yeah, now I'm gonna take the blue, put it underneath. I don't know what, I always, I always put eyeshadow underneath. I feel like I look weird with that eyeshadow under my eye. <laughs> Especially with these big bold colours, I feel like it just looks weird if you don't. Me personally, anyway. So I'm just blending that out a bit, make it look not so crazy. And I'm taking some more on the back, on the fluffy bit of the brush, and I'm going to put this into my crease. Just so it's not all. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what you'd call it. Just so it's not all directly on my eyelids, sort of thing. And I'm taking this. This is a Eco Tools brush. It's, it came in like a travel set. It's very good actually, considering. It's like it's a bit annoying that the face is a bit short, but I'm kind of lucky. I've got small hands, so <laughs> yeah. And I'm taking my um, Nyx Jumbo pencil again. I just love it so much. I just end up using it for everything. It's really bad. So I think that's why I've run it down so much. Yeah, I'm just using this on my waterline, just because I like the um, big anime look. God, look cute. The big eyes. <laughs> and a bit of a hair on my nose. Nightmare. <laughs> yeah, I'm using this... Uh, it's by it's by Avon. It's uh, one of the children's lines called Color Trend. I've had it for ages. It's not it's not bad. Yeah, I'm using this eyelash color. Once again, I have no idea where this is from. Literally, no idea. I can't remember. Probably like Primark or something. I don't remember buying it to be honest. <laughs> and then next, I'm using this Smashbox Full Exp Exposure. It's like the little travel size one. I got it from my, like, my last job. Yeah, it makes a big difference. I'm getting really annoyed at the moment. One of my eyelashes on one side is a bit dodge. I'm missing like half my eyelashes for some reason. The struggle is real. Yeah, I'm taking... What I'm doing here is I'm using... The, there's a... Maybelline have done this mascara called Big Eyes and my smaller side, the smaller brush, has run out of mascara but I'm using the mascara wand with my Smashbox just to get so it's a smaller brush. I'm going back in doing the top lashes because for some reason they did not want to cooperate. Don't know. <laughs> you just Some days you have good eyelash days, this was not one of them. Yeah, and now I'm taking this... Um, eyebrow brush, just brushing out my eyebrows. Yeah, I don't know why, but one of my eyebrows just uh, looks horrific. But yeah, now I'm taking this Avon brush, and uh, I'm using, it's called the uh, Avon Eyeshadow 8-in-1, the nudes. I've had it for ages. I just use it for my eyebrows usually, just the two colours that I showed. I don't really use the rest, so I wouldn't know if they're any good, don't ask. <laughs> I was having a bad eyebrow day as well. Just my eyebrows are really bad at the moment. I don't know why. Yeah. <laughs> Next, I'm taking the Revolution Strobe Balm Palette. I've heard it's a good um, 
dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hill one. I've got both, and to me they're completely different, personally, I don't know. But I'm taking the gold one, like, once again I've hit pan really bad because I use this all the time, but I usually use it for a base, like, I tend to wear two highlighters, not gonna lie, I like to be seen from space a little bit. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just patting that onto my cheeks, my nose, my cupid's bow. And then I'm taking this, I don't really, I think it's a brush set from Avon. All the brushes that I've been using that have got this like greyish tip, I've used them all. They're all from um, Superdrug. It was like a big old set. And I'm taking the Jeffree Star's Ice Cold Highlighter and I just put it over the top of my other highlighter add it to my brow bone as well just because it's like it's quite good together I feel complement each other well and I'm taking this brush and then I'm gonna use my <laughs> I always use eyeshadow for blush just because I really like a pink pink blush and I haven't really got one I've not really found a the pink blush so I'm using this one because you know why not makeup's versatile why not use it for everything <laughs> Yeah, I'm just putting this on my cheeks, and I always put my blush quite high up. And I'm just taking this big fluffy brush and I'm going to blend it out a bit. Don't ask, this bit of hair was annoying me for ages. I don't know, it just was not staying backwards. <laughs> but yeah, next I'm going to take... I'm using, they're like pound, they're Poundland stickers, but to be honest, I don't know if they're safe for your eyes, so don't hold that against me, but I've been using stickers from my face for a while now, and they don't seem to do much, so I always just put them, like, just under my eyes, right there, yep, there. <laughs> and I'm taking this little, I think it's a nail art brush, I think, uh, it's like a really small dotting tool, so there's hair on my brush, weird. But, so I'm just using this to create like white freckles. I love doing this, I don't know why, it just, it just makes me feel cute. <laughs> I don't like normal coloured uh, freckles apparently. I think it's because I've got my own normal coloured freckles, but I just love the white ones. And then lastly, I'm taking this uh, liquid lipstick. Liquid lipsticks are life. If you have never tried them, you have to try them. They are the best things ever. I'm taking Lime Crimes Cashmere and I'm just pouring that on. I love this colour so much. Yeah, that's it. It's not the most outlandish look, but I feel like it's good for every day. And then I just put my Dory on. These Sailor Moon earrings are everything, I swear. And these glasses, oh, they're just amazing. But bye!